Good morning guys, good morning. Welcome back to my channel guys. Hi, if you're new around here, I am Lydia. <laughs> I create travel and lifestyle vlogs. And yeah, welcome to another day, another week of the weekly vlogs. Let me brush my teeth first. Speaking about my teeth, guys, I think I have almost decided, I'm like 99% sure, that I wanna get my teeth straightened at a different place. Listen, my clinic, my teeth clinic is entirely too expensive. So I go to Chelsea Dental Clinic and we've got the best dentists there, but boy, are they pricey. And to be honest, if the goal is to straighten my teeth, then we can get my teeth straighter. Like there's other options of getting my teeth straight that doesn't involve 4,000 pounds. And also, considering the fact that your girl's teeth are actually quite straight. Four thousand pounds? Mm mm. Busy day today. You see these lashes? There's more. In fact, you probably can't see these lashes because there's no lashes to see. Got an appointment with Inga later on today, and I'm also expecting a fun delivery of a mirror. So I am super excited about that. Really excited about that, actually. So yeah, let's let's go and get ready. So I am in my beauty room. I've really been enjoying getting ready in here. It makes such a difference to have all your stuff in one place and then just like close the door and run away. <laughs> run away from all the mess. I can't wait, but like I said before, it's not incom it's not incomplete, it is incomplete. I need to get these plastic acrylic inserts to put in this drawer so that my makeup doesn't get all over it because that's happening. But one thing that I've discovered here is that my paint is actually washable. How cool is that? So if you get marks on it, so long as you get like, um, I use floor wipes but like a damp wipe and you wipe it off it just washes off really neatly so i love that i'm gonna do a quick beat here oh my god i literally am using all of the products that i showed you last time is that a spot that's a very interesting development since when mm -mm -mm. lord knows how i ended up with a full face this setting spray is everything i don't know why i didn't have it before that's nice, I'm trying. I'm trying to figure out a style that I can do by myself at home that's simple and easy, that looks good, doesn't take a lot of time. And I think I wanna carry on working on this. I wanna carry on perfecting my slick. I feel like I have entirely too much makeup on for somebody who's gonna go get their lashes done. I definitely have too much makeup on, but <laughs> this is what happened when I sat here today. <laughs> my bad. Outfit on. Guys, I am so tired of wearing the same clothes. I've been. <laughs> I've been wearing the same clothes literally for the last like year, for sure. There's nothing wrong with wearing your clothes, but personally, I've literally worn the same seven outfits because all my things are boxed away in the shed and I don't even have the effort to do that. In fact, I'm planning on doing a whole wardrobe organization video. Let me show you what my wardrobes are. It's, it's bad. You think it, this room looks really cute? Look at this. Look at this, honestly. This <laughs> Yeah, so I need, and as you can see at the top here, there's literally like four outfits hanging. It's my brown set from Arch Snatch. It's basically all black owned clothing. My dress from Women's Wear. Just basically all of my black owned pieces that I've got in the last months. That's what I've been wearing. I need to do a wardrobe organization video and I'm really looking forward to it actually. And then after that, I can start purchasing things again. These are my new earrings from Kapinga London. I'm gonna list all everything that I mentioned in the description box for you guys to check out. I couldn't even say it's cute because you've seen this outfit a million and one times. Remember I wore it when I was planning my boyfriend's birthday. I wore it to a party. I wore it somewhere else. I'm wearing it today. Recycle and reuse, right? That's the thing for today. You like? Girl, it is hot in here. When is my lash appointment? I need to leave for my lash appointment in the next 10 minutes. But before I leave, guys, I wanted to give a massive shout out to the sponsors of this video who are Surfshark VPN. Absolutely love working with Surfshark because they offer a service which is useful and convenient. Two ticks from me. So if you don't know about Surfshark, they are a VPN service provider. What is a VPN? A VPN is a virtual private network. So a VPN or virtual private network helps keep your identity safe by encrypting any information sent from your device and the internet. Using Surfshark can help in many different ways. I find it most useful when I'm using it outside of the house. So anytime that I need to connect onto a different server or a different network, 
<laughs> I got a VPN that girl. I got a VPN that. Another way that you can use Surfshark is if you want to access and unlock content libraries from other streaming networks. So for example, Netflix, if you want to access American Netflix, or in fact, any other country's Netflix, you can do that by easily changing your virtual location through Surfshark. I have a promo code, which is Lydia Dinger, which gets you 83% off plus an additional three months off for free. Surfshark also offers a 30 day money back guarantee. So there is no risk in you trying it. If you try it, you don't like it. That's it, 30 days, you get your money back, that's it. And the best part is that one account works on unlimited devices. So guys, be sure to open the link in the description box to check out Surfshark VPN and use my code Lydia Dinger. For now, your girl, I'm pretty sure we're running late. This watch is turned off. I can't even check that for time. Pretty sure that we're running, yep, four minutes behind time. So let's head off to Inga to get these lashes done. I'm running late, guys. Not only that, but we're also running out of petrol. <laughs> so I don't know whether to stop for petrol before or after. I don't know if my car's gonna stop me to go and get petrol. It's on the one bar. You know the one bar, the last one? We have just got here, guys. A whole, hmm, a whole 15 minutes late. Really, what's new? My sensitive blinkers are just out here being sensitive. I Literally, it could be a leaf and they're like beeping out here. Anyway, guys, I am 14 minutes late. I feel so bad, I'm literally staring into her house. I feel so bad for being late. I need to work on that because it's a complete disrespect for everybody else's time. On the drive here, guys, I saw like four petrol stations. I was looking at them with lusty eyes. <laughs> lusty eyes. Your girl has no petrol. So please all. Let's go in here and do these lashes and then we can carry on with the rest of the day. So I also added to my accessories by putting this on. It's uh, actually a body chain from Dixie Grays, but I'm wearing it as a necklace today. So I'm gonna link all of the black owned businesses. I'm gonna link all of the businesses in the description box. So please be sure to check it out. Also, there's a video of all of my favorite texts, including Inga. So if you guys wanna see that, oh my God, I see the door opening, guys. See ya. So you guys, I'm finally back. Three weeks later, as usual, I have a standing appointment. I'm talking to you guys with my eyes closed because my eyes are being washed. This is why I was saying earlier, it probably wasn't a great thing for me to put on makeup, but I wanted to have a cute day. <laughs> After a disastrous morning, I wanted to have a cute day, but this is definitely gonna mess up with my foundation and all that, but it's all good. I should have brought spare makeup in the car, to be honest. A little bit washed, but it's gonna yeah. still, still there? Just the wrong. Okay. Guys, you guys know the deal, you know how it goes. If you guys wanna check out what we do here, I've got a whole video with my favorite technicians in London. So go and check that out. But for now, I'm just gonna sit here and get my lashes done. What I usually do is just nap. Like this is my time to nap for like a good hour and a half or whatever, however long it takes. So I'll catch up with you guys after when this is done. She is back, she is better than ever. Inga, every single time. Guys, listen, let me just say now. If you didn't book your appointments for May, you have lacked. All the appointments are finished. They're done, they're gone. Ever since I posted that video, it has just, in fact, I can't lie. Inga's appointments were booked before, but then when I started like showcasing Inga, Inga is now booked, done. The day is the 5th of May. All of the May appointments are done. Forget about it. If you, if you wanted to get these beautiful lashes done, you should have listened when I told you repeatedly. Anyway, the bad news as well is that our good sis is on maternity leave from June. So she's gonna be taking appointments like here and there in June. But if you lacked, you have lacked. I apologize for that. I feel like me all over again. I wanna head off to Greenwich. We're going to Greenwich because we're going to HomeSense. This is probably gonna be the second time ever that I'm going to HomeSense. But a big shout out to Dion for this. So Dion is another black babe on Instagram, like the home side of Instagram. Her handle is monochrome is a palette and her house is literally monochrome and it's so, so freaking cute. Her stair runner is <laughs> literally making me wanna cry <laughs> because I still don't have a stair runner, but let's not talk about that. Honestly, waste of my time, complete waste of time. Uh, I messaged Dion yesterday asking her which home sense she had got her bits from and she said it's the one in Greenwich and she said that they also have lacrosse. There's a way of saying it and I'm definitely not saying it right, but you know the big um, heavy cast iron pans, the orange, that's the orange is typically the one that you, you probably remember of seeing. Um, that brand, the French brand that do the most amazing pans ever, they have them at TK Maxx or possibly HomeSense for like 14 99 she said. So, you know I have to go, I have to. It's, it's for my bank's safety, like it's for my bank account. I am doing this for my bank account. My bank account will thank me because I was about to spend about 170 pounds on pots. 
Let's not talk about it. Yeah, Start me listening to the, the receipts podcast. It's when, I don't know, when men say it, it rubs me the wrong way. Yeah. It's female. It's female. Yeah. 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 I hate that word. It's never yeah. coming from a good place. Yeah. Yeah. Never. Yeah. When women say it, I guess this goes back to us championing women. When women say it, it's never like to be malicious. Men say it, they are trying to be malicious. Mm. I'm sorry, they yeah. are trying to be malicious. <laughs> <laughs> That's absolutely true. I feel like some men use the word females derogatory. First of all, female. Am I canine? Am I a dog? I don't get it. I'm a woman. I am a woman. I am a woman. Female. I really hate that word too. Y'all have a problem with it or is it just me? And they always use it in a derogatory way. It's never like, oh, I met this woman that I like. It's, oh, she was a female. Oh, this, oh, you females. All you females do this. All females do, female? What's going on? It's so rude. Anyway, I'm listening to the uh, Receipts podcast. Please be sure to leave your favorite podcasts as recommendations in the comments because I am always looking for new podcasts to listen to. The To My Sisters podcast, I think I'm their first listener every single week. <laughs> because I rinse that podcast out, boy. I'll rinse it out. In fact, when are you inviting me back on, girls? <laughs> when are you inviting me? Oh, it's my baby. Hey, babe. Hello. I'm good. Babe, my day has flipped completely. It's changed. I can't believe how much things have turned around. To 2019. So it was in the pandemic that stopped you. <laughs> I always feel like such an idiot when I go round the roundabout. So I've just pulled up. Oh, look at God! Look at God! So I'm pulling up to this petrol station, Sainsbury's, and outside of Sainsbury's, I've just seen a Dunham. That's what I wanted to tell you guys. But I've also just seen, as I went round the roundabout, a B&M bargains. <laughs> and I have time today. I am so excited. Why is nobody coming to this queue? Is there something wrong here? I'm gonna do it anyways. Yeah, being in bargain, done home. Y'all gonna see me. <laughs> what? Let's do this. The honest truth, guys. This whole fueling, refueling thing, we need to find a different way around it. In Kenya, they have attendants at the petrol station who fill up the gas, the gas, the petrol for you. The UK, get out. And this whole filling up your car like on a weekly basis, it's annoying. Listen, it's annoying. I've been talking about my tank, like full tank, but the way I just get around, guys, <laughs> Not around, around, but like the way I move about. It's a lot. It's a lot. How can I say the way I get around? Anyway, should we go to Home Sense first or B and M Bargains? To be honest, I wasn't planning on either of them. So, <laughs> shit. Let's do B and M Bargains because I really haven't been there often. Aha. B and M, big brands, big savings. <laughs> Give me that lacrosse, 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 lacrosse. <laughs> Whichever way, give it to me on the cheap cheap. This is gonna be a great day. This is how I like to spend my days, not editing. I'm going to be in them bargains and getting bargains instead. Do I have my mask? <gasps> no, I left my mask at Inga's. My mom has got it into my head that if you buy something, then get the first one, get the one like behind it or the one behind that. Got this, nice and pink. This matches my bathroom as well. How much is that? $6.99. I think that's okay, I think. I need to get towels as well. I wanna get like pink and white matching towels for the bathroom. I just have so much organization to do, but I just don't, I haven't had the time to do it yet. I'm gonna get two bath sheets as well. Okay, let's do some options. What do you think about these, these bits here? George Wilkinson. I really like the handle, I like the wooden handle, I like the plastic and they're three pounds each. It's a bit expensive, but I think it's a bit better than these rose gold ones because my kitchen is gold, not rose gold. I have just got to TK Maxx and Home Sense in Greenwich. Funnily enough, this is where um, Howden's, where I got my kitchen is, literally just across the road. I don't know who pissed the weather off. It's in, it, we're in May. We're in May in the UK and it is still raining. There's still no sun. This country, I feel like I complain about the UK all the time. <laughs> I do, because 
it's worth complaining about <laughs> anyway um let's go in here i've got these yeezy fake these feezies i think that's what uche calls them got these feezies from um Sanilla, my masseuse and they're completely inappropriate for the weather but it is what it is it's doing too much currently in tk maxx i'm heading straight for that home section at the back there i haven't been to a tk maxx that's just all downstairs before there's always an upstairs but this one in greenwich doesn't have an upstairs so let's just go straight to the home section fingers crossed for my lacrosse lacrosse however the hell you say it Do we need branded salt and pepper shakers? How much are these? 9 99 that's such a bargain. They have them in cream, also in grey and in blue. I have no idea what colour to go for. I might just go for the, this one, this nudie one, because I think this will go with everything. Do they even have the butter one? I wanted a little butter tin for my butter. This is 12 99 it's meant to be 31 pounds. Let's get a to TK Maxx is that I'm gonna end up with things that I don't need like now I'm gonna start deliberating about these plates look at them they're like dolphin plates or mermaid plates they've got this really nice iridescent thing about them I don't need them I absolutely don't need them but they're $1.99 so I think I need four what am I gonna do with this starters maybe two four six eight seven eight nine between friends now this is a plate oh, look at that so so sweet it reminds me of something that you'd see like in a moroccan place or something me and vlogging in public is all good i honestly don't mind at all <laughs> so if i'm working i don't expect anybody to cross me yeah any vloggers get their confidence up and just do it this is your job i'm trying to measure using my iphone i've never used this app before so this is a first for me I think that's about seven centimeters. I'm actually leaving as the happiest customer ever. Honestly, that was such a good deal. This rain, oh, look at England, look at the UK. Look at this, you guys. My current footwear situation doesn't work. <laughs> this rain is mad. I am completely soaked. Oh, God. Listen, my car, at any given point, you can go to any event. I've got heels, I've got trainers, I've got shows, I've got outfits, I've got whatever you need. Come to my boot. Literally, I even have going out dresses. I have like so many old poly dresses that I just never got to take out my car. <laughs> Does that even make sense? This is a really cute blanket that is actually wet already. Okay. I must have got it wet when I was getting things into the car. But it was really so kindly gifted to me. It's actually from Dunham, but it was gifted from HM Samuels and they put my name on it. Look, they put my initials in it. LD. And it's so warm. So shout out HM Samuels. I think it's H Samuels, the jewelers. I need to go and find this home sense. So I see if I can spend some more money. That'll make me feel happier. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I had a terrible start to my morning. I didn't talk about it at all because it's not every day you bring bad vibes. It's not every day I'm having a bad day. Sometimes just get on with it. But one time, one of these days, I want to talk to you guys about how I handle disappointment. And in fact, this very situation and how I dealt with it and how God came through for me as per usual. It's like I'm on his direct line. It feels good, bro. But in this rain, I'm driving to the door. Where is it? We are in Home Sense and I got a parking spot right at the front. Like, let's go and check this out. Hopefully, you can get a few bargains. I'm in trouble, guys. Look, the most gorgeous bowls. I'll show you these after. And I know I can't possibly be looking at glasses again, but I am. Look at these. And I need this. I don't need any glasses. I don't need anything. But let me just show you. Oh, it's fluted. Look at that. 
I deserve this, no? I work hard. I pay my bills. <laughs> it's cute, no? We're coming home, baby. <laughs> I wish you guys could see my face. This is why me and my content are good friends because we need to be good friends. Otherwise, I would run out of money because of stuff like this. I need the ball. So if you are looking for this brand, you have to come to this home sense. This is the home sense in Greenwich. They've got them everywhere. Literally look. And for half the price. Literally half the price. I wish they had the pots in the pan because I would have bought those. I don't need any more of this. Do I need any more of these? This is such a nice colour. Wow. Done some more damage in here. More bowls. <laughs> and some glasses it's not much guys it's really not much at all so i have just got home and look at what i have arrived to guys this is so amazing my mirror got delivered so this is a mirror from lena mirrors i came across them on ig and they do these wonderful leaning mirrors called lena mirrors for a reason and it's huge it's so so big oh my goodness this is so 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 cute I love this. This was actually meant to be for my bedroom. But now that it's sitting down here, it got delivered, obviously, when I was away. Now that it's down here, I, I'm digging it. I love it. You like it down here? Mm -hmm. But where are we going to put it? The sofa's going here. Literally right here. Guys, these balloons are still here. <laughs> I don't know if I'm embarrassed. <laughs> oh, so beautiful balloons. Like, I don't even know whether to be embarrassed or not because these balloons have refused to go we're like i think on week four now this is four weeks if you're looking for a party planner if you're looking for balloons you have to go to oh so Butte balloons because this was done for my house tour which was a long time ago we're literally about to go and get sofas at some point this week so yeah sofa's gonna go here so i don't know what do you guys think where do you think we should put the leaning mirror the tv can go there tv's going there sofa sofa like this is that an l shape yeah there's gonna be a chase it's called a chase a chase is gonna go there <laughs> long and then it's gonna come up to here and dot do you know what if it goes to plan mm -hmm. the sofa should come just up until where the radiator is do you know what i mean okay. don't worry that's that's rubbish but it's cardboard rubbish it's like stuff from unboxing things yeah don't worry about it then it might have to go upstairs i think it might into my bedroom it's so so nice lena mirrors guys i have no affiliate with the company besides them gifting this to me and i i actually do want to mention this because it's quite important but yeah i'm getting that they're a small business and they have a lot of deliveries to make you see this mirror behind me that's 95 pounds for that whole thing um and again this is not an ad it's not a promo i don't even need to say it but i know people are going to ask so yeah if you're ordering please bear in mind that there's going to be some long wait times because even me personally i had to wait for my mirror to arrive but they called me yesterday saying that it's been delivered today and it came it came when i wasn't even here but um yeah please bear in mind that they're a small business and they've got tons and tons of orders but obviously that's for them listen i'm not being paid to say none of this i can't wait to be doing selfie selfie gang in this good afternoon guys good afternoon so it's the next day and i have pretty much been stuck here not pretty much i have been stuck here from about 9 a.m editing this vlog that's just gone up you guys if you don't know i am committing i was gonna say i'm promising but i am committing to two videos a week in may the first one you know went up on a thursday as opposed to on a wednesday but it's yeah i mean it's gonna be up so that's what i've been editing today today's thursday so yeah be sure to check out on wednesdays and sundays around 7 p.m for a new vlog subscribe if you haven't and all that all that anyway now that that's all done you guys what you missed is my alarm went off my alarm went off about 10 minutes ago letting me know that i need to go and start getting ready because today is iffy's birthday if he's my hairdresser and we have a reservation somewhere in harrow it's so far literally i don't even know have i been to harrow yes i've been to harrow before for the fat crab, fat crab. You already know that's the that's the best the best cajun seafood boil oh god by the way we have two companies offering us two cajun seafood boils one is a restaurant pelican um, pelican state okay i've been there and they're really good look this is me giving them an ad but for real <laughs> pelican state it's in west in central is it in west or maybe it's like victoria area so the good thing about pelican state is the fact that it's a restaurant so you can just go in and order seafood boil as opposed to with these seafood boil places you usually have to order pre-order mm -hmm. like a week in advance how about how do i know what i'm gonna eat next tuesday like i i don't know what i'm doing today 
<laughs> let alone what I'm eating next Tuesday. So Pelican State is good because you can just walk in and get a seafood boil. However, I have another second company, another black owned company who wants to send me a seafood boil. And I already said yes. So we've got two seafood boil places. Little tangent just came off the fact that I said I'm going to Harrow. Mm -hmm. Sorry for the long vlogs, guys. Let me know, do you guys prefer longer vlogs or shorter vlogs? Because I never know what to do. Is it like a 20 minute thing or a 30 minute thing or a 40 minute thing? Let me know in the comments what your max is. Um, I'm done with work now. It is 4.42, I'm running 13 minutes behind schedule. Always running behind schedule, but it's all good because I need to, um, yeah, I need to go and get ready. And Dot's showing me some heels here, let me see. All my heels are still in the shed. <laughs> And Dorothy's a size six and I'm a size five, but we're just gonna make it work. She actually put these on. Oh, perfect. And then she's got these ones, options. Where are these from, Dot? Put a little thing. I'm driving and then I'm gonna get into the restaurant and sit down. You can walk into the restaurant with those? Yeah, after quarantine. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows? They're cute. This is very um eight, like 70s vibe, no? It's cute. Like flared. This is the option I'm gonna go for. And then I can't wait to show you guys my dress. Oh, damn. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm going for, Doc. Thanks. Strings is just a bit long. Just put these warm shoes for me in the car because this outdoor dining thing. Oh, yeah. It's outdoor dining. You eat a margarita. <laughs> this girl has been saying about margaritas for the last four hours. We're sitting here working. She's like, you think a margarita is a keto? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, no, girl, they're not. I'm gonna take these to the restaurants. How ghetto, but mm -mm. warm. How warm. <laughs> How warm. How very warm. Because outside, I don't know, if you're watching this from outside of the UK, we have had our um, restrictions eased, our lockdown restrictions eased a little bit. So we can now go and eat in restaurants, but you could only eat outside. But the catch is, the gag is, we live in England. <laughs> Old. Besides that, I have this package that I can't wait to show you. This is my dress, black owned, and yeah, you guys just wait, 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 wait until I uh, get ready. Guys, we can catch up when I'm ready because this vlog is already too long. So let's do that. Gang signs. <laughs> just in the middle of getting ready and I've had to cancel an appointment because this week I was hoping to go and get my sofa, or at least, well, no, I was hoping to go to the, go to the showroom to see sofa options, but um unfortunately i can't do the day that i wanted to do anymore and then already can't do the other day that i could do so now we have to do another day so it's gonna be friday next week i can't wait for friday to come like literally i can't wait because we need a sofa <laughs> i'd like to host my friends around you guys for real that's a very long time away I'm sorry, a very long time away. Yeah, dining chairs and so far are really the main big things that are, that are currently remaining. And then coffee table and then accessories and all that. But all that, all that stuff comes later, do you know what I mean? If, for whatever reason, you're wondering what I am doing for my makeup, I am not makeup artist. <laughs> I'm gonna link a vlog up here where um, I was updating you guys on all my new makeup products. Oh, love 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 you can probably see at the back there is my dress which i'm going to be wearing it is from gold sunday gold sunday is a black owned business two sisters shout out to you girls honestly guys this dress i was meant to be wearing it for the bank holiday the bank holiday that it was windy and storming and raining i said it's actually not that it's not that deep it's not that deep i'm a wait i'm a wait to go out so um i didn't get a chance to wear it but then it's if it's worth this day so it's the perfect time to wear it i haven't tried it as you can see and um, i'm meant to be leaving in 15 minutes so it has to fit <laughs> there's no two ways <laughs> there's no middle ground with lydia it's one extreme or the other it's either like super nice or like it's whatever i'm just here i'm just here for the vibes you know if i knew we were going to harrow i would have literally suggested fat crab that's how i spent one of my birthdays guess who is teddy to celebrate my birthday and that was really sweet that was really really nice actually what's not sweet is my workout plan that he's put me on this guy's really kill me all i want to try this today elf lip pumping gloss in champagne it looks really good i like the colors of it look so cute i hope it's black girl friendly i don't want no ash hmm. how am i feeling about this it's giving me nude vibes and it's got that tingling stuff that lip, some lip glosses have. A sensational leet. I did not expect it. I'm gonna make sure I link all the products that I've used in the description box so you guys can test them out. Ooh. Should we go and try my dress on? I got a dash because it's definitely way past the time I should have been leaving. Love this gown. I know you guys are probably gonna ask. Um, this gown is from Primark. I was telling you about it last year. If you didn't get it, it's done. It's gone. It's finished. This is not how you open packages. Oh, that's cute. I am really bad at opening packages. You guys, the more you watch my vlogs, the more you realize I'm a petition of things. 
Nice. Mm. Look at that, Gold Sunday. It says, hey Lydia, thank you so much for showing love to Gold Sunday. We really hope you feel snatched in this adult dress. Hmm. I hope so too, sis. <laughs> ah, made from compostable certified film. Love that. Sustainable babes, that's what we are. Oh wow, look at the packaging. Black owned businesses coming through and sustainable too. And the, this is as well recyclable, you know? We love it. And it's a long dress like this. Oh girl, it is giving. It is giving. Let me even move a little bit so you can see more of it. This is giving everything it needs to give. <laughs> Picture my hair in like a low bun style. I'm even getting hot just thinking about what am I thinking about? I'm getting hot thinking, so stop. Should I go and show it to you in a bathroom where you can see better light? What do you think? You like? You think it's cute? I feel like my, my waist is almost too small. Can you hear that as a statement? My waist is almost too small that it's even a little bit gaffy at the back. Just a little bit. But that's just because the waist is non-existent. This is so cute. Okay, so this and the heels. Let me show you the heels. These. What do you think? Obviously, I can't drive in these. Yes! Lockdown who? Lockdown way you're. Lockdown why? Why when you look this good? Iffy, let's celebrate. Wow. Mm, giving. Wow. Yeah, should be nice. Hey, you look tall as well. <laughs> it's the heels. They're uncomfortable. Not the cute. No brazier. I don't, it's just a constraint from the devil himself. You know what you do need? Huh? To leave. I gotta leave, innit? Cool, let's go, let's go, let's go. So it is 20 minutes past eight and I am not too far off actually, about three minutes away. So I'm so glad I'm out here in sticks. Uh, but the good thing is that uh, it's called the Aqua where we're going and I when I put it on my maps Google Maps it said it's a Lebanese. I love Lebanese. Love Lebanese food and it means that I can also stay on my diet I can stay on my keto um, because I can just have meat and salad <laughs> Lots of salad <laughs> lots of meat. I love Lebanese food. It's literally like one of my favorite cuisines But then again, you'd also be hard-pressed to find a cuisine that I don't like <laughs> I like food that's why I gotta work out. <laughs> I enjoy food a little bit too much. I'm in a great mood listening to Wizkid and Damon Marley. Blessed. Because that's exactly 30 how mile I feel. per hour speed limit camera ahead. Guys, this is literally where Watford Ways. Watford Ways. Um, all London is somewhere around that area. All London is in this area. This is Watford. All London, black owned business for nails. I need to book my next appointment there because the service there. The pedicure that I got there was really, really good. But yeah, I'm a very visual person. Like once I've been somewhere once or seen someone, trust me, I remember it. I won't know the name, I won't know the area, but visually, I know where we are. And the sky is so pretty, wow, I've got a pink sky. I was really hoping to have got parking right next to it, but I have parked literally less than a minute away. What am I gonna do? <laughs> this body? How am I gonna walk across the road with this body? I don't even have a coat. I get really embarrassed sometimes. And this is Lydia who doesn't ever get embarrassed, but sometimes I feel like, especially when I'm not with my boo, mm -mm, I won't be looking this good. Earrings are from Kapinga London, black owned business. Oh my God, I'm blackly black. Almost 100% today because wig, Ify London, birthday girl, obviously. Shout out to Ify London for black owned wigs and uh, Kapinga London on the earrings and Gold Sunday on the dress. I'm gonna take my shawl. And I didn't even carry a nice bag. I've only got <laughs> a delivery bag. No handbag. If you know anything about me, you should already know right now that I hate carrying bags. I've got like um, a strain injury, repetitive strain injury on my left side of my shoulder from university carrying loads of heavy things. <laughs>
Thank you.